peace. Oh, please keep your mind at ease. It's obvious. Yes, I'm outside, I'm outdoors, and there's a lot of kids out here all being loud and playing. They're having a good time. That's great. Because a lot of a lot of older people are are in fear and they're panicking and they're worried and scared. And if you take a close look at what's going on, there's a lot of fear being pushed. And you, and you don't even have to take a close look. It's just it's just fear being pushed out everywhere. And you gotta be able to be able to distance yourself from that and not only that is to not become too self-absorbed into the fear because i am myself reading into a lot of information doing so much research about what's going on and yes it seems that there are things going on behind the scenes and and you may be going really far into this and getting scared and that's okay that's all right but you have to really be able to take a moment, take a step, take a step back and realize that everything's gonna be okay. Stay positive and raise your vibration during these times. It's so important that we raise our vibration. That's the most important thing that we can be doing right now for ourselves and reminding others of in these times with the coronavirus and it can be super difficult it can be super difficult someone's listening right now it can be difficult because you might have a lot of people around you who are worried and they and they might be telling you to be scared but like i said can't let this fear get to you. You know, your immune system becomes compromised when you're in a state of fear. You are a lot more susceptible to a lot of damage in your own internal state when you're being, when you're in fear. Doctor, his name, I think Dr. Moto, is that, is that correct? He has shown that water has memory and water can react to words, to music. Here, I'll put it up right here. Look. So, negative words, negative words have shown water to not take a very crystal-like state. But as you can see, the positive words, look how, look how it makes the water react. It makes the water react so beautiful, so crystalline, right? Do you remember that we are humans that are made up of around 70% water? We are made of almost entirely of water, right? And if you really took a look at that and you noticed how water can change based on the information that's being given, it's quite it's quite mind-blowing. It's amazing. It's incredible. And it should only it should only inspire you and make you hopeful because you have a certain control. You do. In these times where it seems like you might not have control, you do have control over your own internal state. You can be positive for yourself. You can tell yourself positive messages you can follow people that are positive don't just follow those who are scaring you can't go too far onto one side you have to have a balance follow people that are going to give you positive messages follow me on instagram at office <laughs> follow people that are going to uplift you and right now you might not be able to be around people that are going to be uplifting in these current times with the quarantine and all but you have control over your your own internal state you do have some control there you can meditate and as i made in one of my previous videos meditation has shown to decrease the neural connections of fear meditation has shown 
It has shown through graphs, experiments, that meditation can form the neural connections that you need to be at a calm state more often. You won't, you won't have so much fear. You won't have so much fear if you're meditating. You're gonna be more connected with the whole universal consciousness. You will be more connected to this universe more than ever the more you meditate. You'll be calmer. Your anxiety will start to diminish, it will fade away. Your depression will fade away. You will learn gratitude and you will learn to love yourself. And that's one of the most important messages that I can push out for you today. It's to love yourself, to have gratitude. Have gratitude because you are alive and to be even alive is just, just about a miracle. It is such a blessing to be alive. Stay positive. You can change your internal state. Give yourself positive affirmations. Meditate daily. Meditate daily. I've learned to change the dialogue in my head. I used to be extremely negative. I used to be pessimistic. But I learned to not attach myself with the thoughts. I learned that I had to let go of the judgment. I had to let go of my judgment towards those thoughts. And you, you can do that with meditation. And positivity can become a habit for you. Because that's what we need right now. Everybody needs to be more positive. And the universal consciousness vibrational fields will raise. That's what we got to do right now. Take a, take a moment. <sighs> Breathe in. Remember, you are alive. You are alive. And you are a miracle. You are amazing. You are divine. You are a star. And you are a universe. You are a universe. Love yourself. I wish you so many blessings. And I wish you the ultimate best. Peace, oh please. Keep your mind at ease. It's obvious.